medical student from Ireland. Hi, I'm Izzy. I'm a final year from Bart's. And I'm well, I'm also from Bart's. Okay, so this is the ileostomy that's defunctioning with two limbs, one here and one there, which will mobilise first of all during the operation. Make a, a midline incision, just about the umbilicus to the pubic bone here. Again, to open the wound into the abdominal cavity. This is cutting through the rectus sheath here, uh, and this is going to be going into the peritoneal cavity. We're just going to dissect it out a bit further, and hopefully get inside the peritoneal cavity. So we've just now entered the peritoneal cavity. Right in here is the abdominal cavity with its organs, okay? As you can see. You. You can see when you enter the cavity is the omentum here, and the small bowel loops as soon as you enter the cavity. To the small bowel, that's the DJ flexure at the top, and the small bowel goes all the way towards the terminal ileum. We're going to mobilize that now and keep it away. I tend to bring the bowel with two uh, uh, packs so that we can leave it outside and pack it away so we get space in the abdominal cavity, like so. So that wraps it up. This is the sigmoid colon and the line of reflection here, which is the, the white line here, which I'm going to reflect all the way up uh, to the splenic flexure. This is the uh, sigmoid colon, and this is the ureter just in here, which we lift up and it vermiculates and contracts. As you can see, just that. Large bowel, and you can see the, uh, the tinea coli muscle running down, and also the appendices, epiploces, these fat tags. This is a small bowel. There's no appendices of plosis, no tinea coli, the mesentery is up towards the edge of the bowel. It's completely different in calibre to the large bowel. The colon going to the rectum with the uterus and the fallopian tube and the ovaries in the pelvis. We're going to be dissecting out that plane right in the pelvis. Going to the TME plane behind the rectum all the way down to the tumour way down in the pelvis. This is the resection of the colon and the tumour that's here, all the way down to the pelvic floor, and it's been excised, as you can see. The cavity all the way down to the sacrum at the back and the pelvic floor at the bottom with the ovaries and flaping tubes either side, and that's where it's been resected from. So this is the tumour again, and this is the inferior mesenteric artery, which we're going to ligate now, and then divide the bowel and bring out a colostomy. I can do it myself, actually. Ready? Okay, can we go in? Oh, we can do it by the phone, can't we, this one? Oh, it'd be better quality, won't it? So this is the resection, this is the tumour, and that's the tumour here, as you can see, quite nasty. It's all been excised. Good operation is this, right? All right, let me see. Make sure you don't get me in the background, I've got image rights. <laughs> <laughs> Second Joe Sanger. I love you, Oh, okay, yeah. With a background, yeah. It looks like a part of the.